Okay, so we're gonna learn how to weave. Now the first thing you have to do is get your yarn. Now over on the over on the supply table, there are going to be boxes. And in those boxes, there's going to be yarn coming out of the top. Here's, an, here's one of the boxes. Now each one of these yarns is coming out of a little slit. And I've done that so that the yarn doesn't fall back in. Now you don't need to ever open these boxes, okay? If there is a slit and yarn is not coming out of it, come get me. Now, you're gonna pick out what kind of yarn that you want. And I think I'm gonna start with this light blue. You're going to get a craft stick like this. And you're going to put the yarn around the craft stick a couple of times. And then you're going to continue to wrap the yarn around the stick. Now this is what's gonna be called a shuttle. And that is the official word that weavers use for the stick that has all of the yarn on it. You're gonna wrap it around, keep wrapping it. And I'm pulling the string out of the box as I'm wrapping it up. You can see I'm just wrapping it around. And I wrap it back and forth. All right, until I've got quite a bit there. Now, when you cut off the yarn out of the box, do not cut it way down here by the box. Leave a little extra strain so it doesn't fall in and so that people can easily get it. Cut that off right there. Okay, then go sit back down at your table with your loom. Now, zoom into the loom here. Okay. Now, the thing about weaving is that the thing that you have to remember is under, over, under, over, under, over. You're gonna take this stick here and you're gonna go under, over, under, over, under, over, under, over, under, over, like that. Then you pop it up. Now you've got a little tunnel, okay? Then you've got your little shuttle here. You're gonna go in the tunnel. You're just gonna leave a little bit off to the side here. And you come down. Now, then you're going to do the opposite. So before we went under, now we're gonna go over, under, over, under, over, under, over, under. And then flip it up like that and push it down. Now, see how this string here, do you see how that string right there is under it, or is over? So the string is under the stick. So we pull it out and we do the opposite. Over, under, over, under, over, under, under, just like that. Pop it up. And put the shuttle through all the way. Now, it's important that when you're doing that, you don't pull it tight, because what ends up happening is you end up getting this hourglass. You don't want that. So you leave it nice and loose, and then shove it down and do the opposite. Pop it up. Pull it through, don't pull too tight. Leave it nice and loose. Push it down. Now, I can see I'm doing it wrong because, or I'm doing it right because the yarn is the opposite of the stick. See that right there? Let me zoom in for you. So you can see here, we've got the yarn and how that is going over the stream. So on this next one, we need the stick to go under the string. Just like that. Pop it up. Put the shuttle through the 
tunnel there. Smash it down. Now, I'm going to show you what happens if you do accidentally do it incorrectly. Let's say I do the exact same thing on accident that I just did. Here's what's going to happen. When you pop it up and you put the shuttle through, you're just going to unweave. So it just unweaves what you just did. And that's how you know you did it incorrectly. So that's how you know you need to do the opposite. This is, weaving is all about patterns and opposites and opposite patterns. Just like that. Okay? Now I'm gonna have you guys do at least one layer of just regular weaving like this, and then I'll show you some fancy weaving next week. Okay, so we're gonna do about this much of just a regular pattern. Now you could do a regular pattern like blue, red, blue, red of horizontal stripes. And then next week I'll show you some ways that we can make some different kinds of patterns in this weaving. All right.